from Minnesota's most watched station. This is WCCO 4 News, live at the Minnesota State Fair. Hi, I'm Nacia. And I'm Duke. This is your WCCO at the State Fair newscast. We begin today with a developing story from the Midway. Right now, State Fair officials are now on the lookout for a giant stuffed gorilla. We are told it's black and lime green and is at least eight feet tall. It was last spotted near the Ferris wheel. Officials don't think that he's dangerous, but if you see him, call 911. Over near the pet center, fairgoers are reporting a strange howling sound. Officials were called in to investigate. It turns out it was just the dogs at the pet center trying to keep up with all the people belting out Ursher and Sam Hunt songs <laughs> at the giant sing-along. That's a look at your state fair headlines. Let's send it over to sports. Hi, I'm Young Tiz with a look at sports. A bit of controversy is brewing after a new grand champion was named in the state fair ring toss rodeo. A 10-year-old girl from the Iron Range went 5 for 5, beating our own Chris Schaefer by 1. WCCO's investigative team is on the story. It looks like the 10-year-old was a ringer brought in from Iowa. We'll continue to follow this story, but right now, let's get a look at the weather. Thank you. It's a hot one out here at the Minnesota State Fair. So hot that ice cream cones are melting in less than two minutes. Snow cones are lasting only about three minutes. And a warning that brain freeze numbers have tripled this year as fairgoers try to keep cool. I'm Mandy in the Weather Center. Back to you. That's your news for today. I'm Nacia. I'm Young Tiz. And I'm Duke Blocks. Thanks for watching WCCO4 at the State Fair. This has been a WCCO4 news update from the Minnesota State Fair. Thanks for watching.